Welcome to the Super Facts Show on the Super Facts Network. Featuring St. Laz, who also hosts the popular web series Gem Pop and music journalist Mark Walter Ward. They have discussions about hip hop, culture, society, philosophy, and everything else. Now available on YouTube and wherever else you get your podcasts. What up, world? It's your boy, Mark Walter Ward, Super Facts Show, Super Facts Network. We got Cameron Carty, the greatest engineer of all time, with us today. How you doing, brother? My guy. I'm blessed, my brother. How are you? Chilling, chilling. I, I, I see that, you know, you stepping out of the, or I guess stepping into the limelight, you know, um, are, you, you're, you're working towards releasing a whole project, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I got like, I'm doing like eight singles and then I'm going to re release an uh, album after that. Well, the first single, Get Along, which, you know, is, I mean, we, 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 we could debate on where that ranks among the all-time female posse cuts. Like, for real, that, 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 that's right up there. Uh, Cameron Carty, check it out on um, Spotify, Apple, Dirty Glove Bastard, featuring Renee Rucci, Salma Sims. Mariah Lynn and Johnny Blaze, all of whom I'm, I'm sure I'm sure everyone hearing this is familiar with at least two of them, but everybody around the world is familiar with all of them. If that makes any sense, so exactly uh, that bitch went that bitch went crazy too, bro. Like I'm saying, that's one of the best female posse cuts. I mean, I, I, I don't even know if we're supposed to be ranking shit like that, but I remember I was listening. I was, I was like, I can't even think of a joint that's better than this off the top of my head, you know? Right. But how 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 that song come to be? Like like uh, like. You, so really how'd you get all of them together so really man shit there wasn't none of them together so really what happened bro like you know i've been putting together music like trying to trying to be like take over this dj Khaled thing you know and i heard that me, me and rennie been locked in for a while and we, we was in doing features one night and i was like yeah well, uh knock out a quick little 12 for me real quick for my project we didn't have a hook or nothing. It just had a beat I was doing. And uh, she just knocked out a quick little 12-bar 12, 12 verse. And from there, I just shot it over to Salma. And, you know, Salma's, uh, that's that's 24 hours with fiance or whatever. And she got a lot of connections like Wiz and like Made in Tokyo, all of them. So I shot it to her and she dropped a hook to it. And uh, after I had that hook, I just hit up Mariah after like hearing what she did and then the the tone of Rennie's voice. I just hit Mariah and got her to jump on it. And then after that, I was like, "Shit, I'm gonna do something ain't nobody done yet." With this ratchet ass song, put a dope ass singer on it. Right. And then so shit, I put Johnny on that bitch and man took took some uh, ad libs out of Mariah's verse and put them into the hook to give it like a little kind of ratchet sound. You know what I mean? And, and shit, I felt like that. That's a. I feel like that motherfucker hit. It has some money to, to like push it. Like these other songs getting pushed, it definitely be on top ten. Man, you. you I, I know y'all heard him say it took some ad libs out of Mariah and put it in Johnny Blaze part. That's why you pay for good engineering. But then, no, nah, for that, real. You you drop you drop the video and and the, the video is crazy. I, I guarantee that. Uh, and anyone who's, who's who's interested in in things that are visually appealing will will, will love this video. How, how the video come along, and then then it got took down off World Star. What happened with that? Nah, so it didn't get taken down off World Star. It got taken down off my YouTube oh, because okay. they 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 were supposed to. I guess uh, it was supposed to be like a World Star exclusive or whatever. And my youth on my YouTube, it was doing numbers. It was doing like I think like fifty, sixty thousand. In like three days, so that they got it slowed down to where there's there it would more traffic would be towards theirs, because uh, because they uploaded onto uh, the top box on World Star and then on their YouTube. Got you, and and just just out of curiosity, what 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 have been some of the responses on social media to the video? Bro, man, everybody been loving that shit. Like, I mean, my boy, uh, so my boy Brandon. Work, he he shoots uh, all uh, dirty glove bastards uh, off the porch shit. Yeah, BCP. So Brent, shout Brent, out, Brent shout Brent out. Collins, shout out my boy. He shot he shot everything except for Salma and Mariah because Mariah shot hers up in New York 
and Salma was moving around so much. She had to shoot hers in L.A. But he put it all together and edited everything. But he shot and he did shoot Rennie and Johnny's part. But we shot it so damn random. Like, we shot Johnny's part first and then came back and shot Rennie's part, then shot Mariah's part, and then came back and shot uh, Salma's part. And I think it ended up getting edited, like, damn near the, the day it was supposed to come out. So we got lucky on that. But Brandon, man, that's my boy. That boy's fire. And shout out to Hip Hop. That's how I be up against the deadline shit. I tell you what, though, bro, after I put it on Dirty Glove Bassett, the uh, the YouTube screenshot, but that, that's like the thirstiest comments I ever had on my Instagram because I guess people was just seeing the picture thinking I was the girl. Yeah, and it was all like dudes with eyeballs in my jokes. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro, it's a, it's a, all them comments, bro. It's it's some thirsty ass dudes, but I get it though, man. That's how we set it up. Like we set that shit up to be like that. And God bless thirsty people. They they buy music, right? Nah, for sure, exactly. I, and then Mariah, man, Mariah, her fan base is crazy, boy. She when she posts something, they on that YouTube. They support the shit out of her. You know, they, they buy her shit. They, they stream her shit. They support the shit out of Mariah Lynn. Shit, that's what's up. Shout out to Mariah Lynn's fan base. Hell yeah. Like, if you go and look on them world star comments, other than like the trolling and all that shit like that, you're going to see people Mariah this, Mariah this, Mariah this, because all her fans went that shit and supporting. Well, that's what's she up, got a, she got a She got a dope fan base. I'm sure you about to have one too, but shit, bro. That, 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 thank you for your time. I, I know you're busy. We, we, we gonna let you get on out here and uh, see you soon. Yes, sir. I appreciate you, brother. No doubt. The Super Facts Network, home of Jet Pop, SCE, and the Super Facts Show, now available on YouTube or wherever you get your podcasts from. Come check out St. Labs, G from the Shop, and Mark Walter Ward.